Where did you get that? Oh, he never reveals his source. <laughs> it's funny, cos Dad got Ronnie one just like that for Christmas. Ah, that's a... There's a coincidence. Yeah. And here's another one. I, uh, I heard Ronnie on the phone to a friend yesterday. Why is he selling Dad's gift? I don't concern myself with such details. How much do you pay for it? Go on, I'll, I'll match it, whatever you paid. What's that? Hmm? Oh, wellies. They're yours. It can get wet in Whitby. Now, I've got wellies. <laughs> no, Ronnie, you've got work boots. You'll have to stop buying me things, you know that. Fair enough. You owe me £79.95p. <laughs> Give four, but I'll never pay more than the tenner. <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, do you really think this trip's a good idea, you know, with Lachlan's trial coming up and that? Uh, we can plan round that. Oh, great, I'm starving. Oh, uh, sorry, I've only cooked for two. Oh, that's no matter, I'll, uh, I'll make an omelette. <laughs> oh, and, um... <clears throat> I think that might be yours. Where'd you find that? Well, no, I didn't find it. I bought it off Eric Pollard. Ready cash talks, doesn't it? How much did you pay, Eric? Three thousand. Well, you only give me two. Which you then gave to your bit on the side. I heard you on the phone. What's she on about? My mate Greg. I rebuilt his farmhouse. He's got a 1951 Turner Yeoman rusting away in his barn. 1950? Merry Christmas. Oh! You got me a vintage tractor. I remember I used to bang on about them. I thought it'd be fun to do it up and take it to some of them farm shows. <laughs> Thank you. I thought he was whipping you off. Sorry. You must be hungry. Come on, take a seat. Here we go. 